Hello all. Today we are at 38 Easy Street in Tejeras, New Mexico. We're about to see a three bedroom, two bath home, which is a little under 1900 square feet. Uh, it's got a two car garage. Um, there is a well and septic on the property as well as propane for, uh, for your water heater and your house heater. Um, we're sitting on an acre of land. That would be a driveway. It is gated. You've got plenty of parking. So you've got a parking parking lot there, basically. Your driveway goes all the way up to the house. You've got two cars that you can put inside the garage. The property line is back there where the telephone pole is. The entire lot is fenced in and there's a matching fence that's on the swing gate so if you have dogs they've got plenty of room to roam all of the trees were just lifted so you have real good access to the entire front yard and it is all shaded in pines and pinions and junipers you've got a gravel walk <coughs> excuse me that comes up to the front door and as we approach the front door you're met by a pavered landing and this is covered, by the way. Let me zoom out a little more. There we go. All the doors have uh, New Mexico-style steel mesh on them so that you can keep them open and, uh, I guess, keep the bears out. The floors are done in a Spanish tile. As we enter, you'll see that there is a coat closet here to the right. If we go to the left, we've got a pantry underneath the stairs that go up to the second floor. Let's go, let's go to the right first. You have two bedroom downstairs and one bedroom upstairs. This bedroom is a pretty good size. You've got uh, double sliders the closet doors this room is probably 10 by about 10 by 12 immediately to the right and then we'll show you the rest is the garage you'll see when we get to the living room that there is a pellet stove and all of those bags there are pellets and you're welcome to use them There's your pressurization tank for the well. Uh, there is a water softener. That's your furnace and a fairly new hot water heater. Laundry is here to the left. So we're back to where bedroom number one was. Laundry gets really good natural light. This window faces to the west, so you'll have great light in the afternoon. Bathroom number one is here. This, uh, this bathroom has a tub. The upstairs also has a tub and a shower. You've got a single vanity. And you'll see that the, the tub and the tiles are in really good shape. Just past that bathroom is bedroom number two. This bedroom is a little bit smaller. It's probably... 11 by 11, maybe 10 and a half by 10 and a half. Also has a slider closet. And this window faces to the west as well. Coming back through, I'll take you to the kitchen in a second, but out into the living room, you'll see that we have 16, probably 20, maybe 24 foot ceilings in this room. All the woodwork is matching, including the beams over all of the windows. There is the pellet burning stove I was telling you about. And this flooring carries throughout the entire downstairs, except for the two bedrooms, which are carpet and the bathroom. Your kitchen is here. Tucked underneath this alcove, 
your kitchen window faces west and you've got uh, really good views of your property. Stainless steel sink, stainless steel uh, dishwasher, which is an LG. You've also got an LG French door bottom freezer refrigerator. There is one glass cabinet. All the cabinets are done in knotty pine. You've got a double oven, which is also LG, as well as matching microwave. And the microwave does have a vent hood on it. Just off the kitchen, is your newly finished patio, or deck I mean. That is the window to the loft, I'll show you that. So there's an artist loft that could also be used as an office. This is a great place to telecommute from. It's very quiet and you've got lots of space in this home. At the end of the deck there are steps that go down to the front yard. And the front yard is a series of walkways. Everything is beneath the pinions. This loops right back around to the front door. There's a view from here. Coming back in, we're gonna go across the great room here. And we'll look back the other way. And right up there is the artist loft or workspace that I was telling you about. So let's go up and take a look at that. This entire section is done in wood. And you've got fantastic views of the whole house from up here. If you can see this, Let's see if I can zoom you in. You've got pretty good mountain views from this floor as well. These are the views to the south. You've got two skylights up here so you get fantastic natural light. Just off of the artist loft is the master bedroom. Master bedroom is quite spacious. It also has a couple of skylights in it for some natural light. And it's pretty spacious. It's, uh, it's about, I'm gonna say 14 by probably 18. The master also has double doors that lead out onto a private deck and here's your views from your deck headed back in master bath is right here and you've got a single vanity. You've got a massive walk-in closet. Uh, the, this entire bathroom is done in the same type of tile as downstairs, it is a ceramic. Uh, you do have baseboard heating upstairs. And plenty of storage above the door as well. And then, just around the corner is your walk-in shower. It's done in a beige 4x4 tile. This window faces to the north. And then you've got these massive skylights over the tub. And your water closets around the corner. 
So there you have it. This again is 38 Easy Street in Tejeras, New Mexico, and it is for rent. My name is Dan O'Brien. If you have any questions or if you'd like to see the property in person, please call me at 505-209-3902. Again, 505-209-3902. Dan O'Brien.